Let's get into Queen Sugar. Y'all, when I tell y'all this show was so a freaking good. So let's start out. Um, Charlie has finally moved out of the mill and she in her own house. And New Orleans is all hyped about this big high school game, this rival game, whatever. No finally deso- uh, decided to talk to the people her ex boo hooked her up with, and they interested in a, in a book deal that come with a six fi- figure bonus. And if she don't take it, I mean, and they just want some of her best speeches and quotes. Go on, girl, give it to them. So anyway, Blue starting to rebel. His mom not being pres- uh, present. He talking back to his daddy. Don't want to do nothing. Shoving kids at school, acting out. Just not even here for nothing. And the boy not stupid. He seen his daddy boxing his stuff up, or, or his mama's stuff up. And they just need he need to go and tell tell the boy what's up because he ain't really studying. Now Charlie messing around with these landers. It, it, y'all go on and tell me what y'all think about it because. I already know this little deal. She trying to sign with these Landry's and it's going to blow up in her face. Now, I think Jacob will probably try to do halfway right because he wanted Charlie Pennis, but the dad is not going to do right because he's just too dirty. And and Charlie, uh, Charlie shouldn't be signing nothing with him because I don't think her daddy would approve of nothing that she doing right now in this whole situation. He wouldn't even approve of her talking to none of them. So I don't think whatever she trying to do that she think going to get Shut them down. I I think it's gonna hurt them before it help them. But anyway, I'm glad to see that um uh, Ballard is doing good and she doing great, looking good as always. She in Hollywood discussing they wedding and Poe uh rap Angel. He's sucking around because he was supposed to be doing his own wedding and now Darla got this baby. I mean, the the messed up they whole relationship where her dad is just broke it down to him. But, you know, it's something that probably should have come out before they got married anyway, but still. Um, he, um, he finna start acting out, sleeping with a whole bunch of people and being a whole, trying to get over Darla, and I don't even agree with that. And then, he got the test results. Is the baby his? Is Blue his or not? Cause he keeps saying it don't matter, but you know how this show go. He may be saying it don't matter because he mad at Darla, but Blue still his. But I don't know because right now I I feel like to me Blue is his. But then I'm taking it as the way he's saying it don't matter that Blue ain't his. I don't even know. Tell me what y'all think. Cause my daughter was like, oh my goodness, Blue not his, and I'm like, they got to be lying. Blue his. It's just this. This is a catch twenty two to this. Cause Blue his, you can't tell me that. Y'all tell me what y'all think, because we was just all up and roaring so over. We was just all just screaming and hollering and crying and going on, and just a hot mess. But anyway, they get to this big high school game, and they have what's been going on in society where everybody taking a meal or whatever, doing the anthem or whatnot. And I'm glad they worked this into the show because there's so many both black and white people that don't know what this means. And it's not that they're trying to disrespect the flag or anybody else what what the problem is police brutality is real and it's real against black men and black people in general and people need to start acknowledging it they're not going to acknowledge it until it starts happening to them until it starts happening to white people it's not going to be acknowledged it is what it is and i'm just going to have to say it until they start getting treated like black people are getting treated and harassed like black people getting harassed is not anything is going to be done by it. that's why people are, t- are taking a stance to it and people are kneeling to it because in america things like this shouldn't be happening america is the only racist country and i'm gonna tell you why it's racist do y'all know that america is the only country that asks for race on anything on any application and on any form if they're not racist then why are they asking no other country asks. why is america the only country that asks because they're racist there i said it. if you didn't know now you know so anyway, Charlie at the game, and she seen the cop that harassed Micah. And he had like, ain't nothing ever happened. Had his grandkids, everything's cool and copacetic. But yet, and still, she get, she sees the video, and she know he, he cricket, and he ain't right. And she seen the video, she watched the video, and it is what it is. And it pissed me off when Micah told his mama, you can't freak out every time I'm not here. Yes, you can freak out. Because as a parent, I do the same thing with my kids. You got to tell me where you are. I don't know if you being... Um, beat up, killed, harassed by the cop on the side of the road. So you gotta tell me where you are because that's how things are. It is what it is. 
Now let's get on to Remy. Remy ain't here for the BS, Charlie. You can't smile all up in um, Jacob's face and be flirty and think you, uh, right after you talk to Remy and think you're going to go back to his face. He ain't here for the city slick uh, females. He here for the country females. He ain't trying to get down like that. He he put you he put you in your place last season, honey. So um, you should have been listening to him. You need to learn to listen because he ain't, he ain't feeling it. He ain't liking it. He ain't about to rock with it. So, you know... I think this is going to be a good season. Blue wants his mama home. Um, Violet is overwhelmed by Hollywood trying to see about her. But I like how Hollywood stood up to her. Because he, he like, girl, I'm your man. And it don't matter what you say. I'm going to be here to see about you. You can get mad about it if you want to. But, honey, this is what a man does. And this is what I'm going to do. So you might as well go on and get ready and accept it. Because it's my job to see about you. That's what I'm saying. And the guy that played Hollywood, he done lost weight, looking good. But we're not going to get into that because that man too damn fine. He was already fine, but honey, he looks so good. I like that real um, touching moment that um, Prosper, uh, Prosper and Charlie had because she said him being there is like having a piece of her father there and she appreciate everything. And I really like that because he a good man and he, he is like a father figure. But anyway, I'm here for Queen Sugar. It, it's already going to be a good season just from the previews. We about to get into it. And... Um, I'm ready for it to go down with darling Ralph Angie because he wasn't giving her the time of day. He was shading her like Remy was sh shading Charlie. So, hey, we here for it. We'll see y'all in the next episode.